Hi, it's Michael Fullan. It's great to be part of uh, launching a new report that Maria Langworthy and I just completed called Towards a New End, New Pedagogies for Deep Learning. So uh, this is a report done on behalf of a partnership. Uh, there's several partners that are pooling their interest uh, to uh, kind of map out three big, uh, I think, aspects of it that really are very promising, exciting. Uh, one is what we call the push and pull problem or push and pull dynamic. Schools are really now increasingly boring for students the way they're organized so that it really is difficult to engage students in the present system. Uh, equally important, I think, and maybe even more so, is that teachers are alienated. They're off kilter. Uh, they're, I, I could say that there's, one, there's only one thing worse than uh, having uh, being bored every day, and that is having to teach those who are bored. So teachers are alienated for a lot of reasons. So we have a, uh, uh, that's the push factor. Teachers and students in equal measure are being psychologically, in, ca in many cases, literally, being pushed out of the current system. The pull factor is the increasingly dynamic world of the digital, of digital innovations. In a companion report, Caitlin Donnelly and I called that alive in the swamp that this uh, that it is a swamp we're being uh, inundated it's murky it's mysterious but there's also all kinds of possibilities things are alive and things are exciting so we're pulled towards the digital world not that it's always productive in fact that's part of our analysis it can be a, a waste of time or, or even worse but in that push and pull dynamic lies the new vision that we map out in the paper so that's one point second point is that that way of mapping it out includes defining, as we started to do in the paper, what do we mean by the new pedagogies? Yes, it's a learning partnership between students and teachers and among students and among teachers. So what does that actually look like when it flourishes? So we have that pedagogical partnership. We have deep learning. Deep learning, what, is it, what are the key skills here? Uh, can we, is it collaboration, citizenship, global education, uh, 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 communication, problem solving, critical thinking. What do those actually mean when you operationalize them, when you try to assess them and measure them? When you try to say, what, is, uh, what does instruction look like, teaching and learning with the new pedagogy and the deep learning moving towards each other? So this is a big uh, dynamic. But I think also very important about this report and our intended action, the group of us, the partners, is that we see the answer not in continuing to map out in a kind of research uh, distant way, what, a, what the, the immediate future looks like, but really uh, creating it uh, with clusters of schools where the, the partners, uh, clusters of schools around the world, uh, maybe up to a thousand schools and ourselves working together where some of this creativity is already happening on the ground, but to provide a framework for focusing it, a framework for learning from it and for people getting excited more and more committed so uh, one of the things that's happened with technology and for that matter, good pedagogy is it's failed at the implementation stage. And we think we have a framework that gets people in early that deals with a very attractive and necessary uh, solution, necessary because of the push factors and attractive because there really is exciting learning that just is kind of goes off the top of what's been possible up to this point. So there are things coming together now, converging uh, between uh, uh, those that are learning in schools and in the environment and those that are trying to shape it. There's a really strong affinity now, strong possibilities for solutions. And in this uh, new vision for action, which we initially map out in this paper, we hope to create in the next two years, three years, many examples which are very clear, uh, operationalized, exciting, innovative, uh, and also give them the message about where we should be going more in the next phase and provide evidence, uh, deep learning that we've never seen before, the likes we've never seen before, and excitement on the part of students and uh, teachers in large numbers, not just a few boutique schools, but the normal whole system being engaged. So whole system change, these dynamics, fantastic opportunity. The next three years are going to be great if we could just get in there and do uh, what some of these th uh, possible things are, uh, are almost pointing us to do, but getting in there proactively together and creating it together, assessing it and building on it.
so i hope you'll be invited into that you'll feel invited and you'll be part of that evolution